Welcome to another episode of the Pat Down. I'm here with Chris, Dion, and my son, Nakia. And on this episode, we learn a lot of shit. <laughs> Dion used to be a prostitute for gas money. <laughs> <laughs> you won't that. even believe how old this woman was <laughs> oh my god i think she might have went to middle school with uh president uh truman <laughs> no. uh-uh. she went to high school with jimmy carter stay tuned after the music and see who dion fuck for some gas money All right, y'all, we got a few days. Three days before the Miss Pat Show premieres the third season. Are you excited? How was the premiere last night? Was it last night? No, I was uh, Saturday. It was so good. And so it was so good. It was last minute and boy, did we pull it off. It was great. It was a yep. lot of fans came out. It um, looked pretty. It was very pretty. It, we had a good time. We really did. I want to thank everybody who got an opportunity to come out. I had to cut it off. It went up so fast. Before I knew it, it was up to 300 people. And I hadn't even invited the crew yet. <laughs> and so I guess about <laughs> maybe three, 400 people showed up, something like that, maybe more. But I was like, babies are insane. <laughs> I love my fans, man. I got the best fans ever. They, they so yeah, down. They had the whole highway. Like traffic, like crazy. And they always going to that show. They're like, like right Russian bots. The They're like Russian bots when Taylor Swift goes on sale. They just start snapping up tickets left and right. I hope so. But um, uh, let me tell you what I did today. I went to the grocery store, right? And I went to go. I said, I want some fried chicken. Look at that cat with his ass in your face. <laughs> that lets you know Kristen yeah. sniffing them. He that cat the Put the goddamn cat down <laughs> <laughs> So you went to get fried chicken? Where? No, I fried chicken today. It was horrible. I can't cook. You tried to fry chicken? You might as well have gone to KFC. <laughs> I don't Bless know if my heart. taste... I think my taste bud is gone. I think I killed my own taste buds. With that fried chicken? I was like, oh, I'm going to make me some fried chicken, some macaroni and cheese. It was fucking tasteless. <laughs> what did you season it with? Slap your mama seasoning. It wasn't even slapping up. It was so funny. I think that seasoning only works if your mama's still alive. <laughs> <laughs> it was not good. I mean, you know, my husband put so much hot sauce on it. He <laughs> thought he was trying to kill us. <laughs> <laughs> he was. I know. He said, "Bless your heart." It, it was. It was just horrible. Gariana <laughs> don't cook no more. Yeah, yeah. where's Gariana? I was just about to ask. She cooked for herself now. I asked, she was actually cooking. I'm like, "We can cook like, for myself." I'm like, "Okay." She cooked up some whole cakes. This is where you're going wrong with this new house and four kitchens. They're going to be cooking for themselves in other kitchens, and then you're going to be stuck with your own food. <laughs> Now, my husband cooked pretty damn good, but it, it sucked. I was like, I really don't like cooking. <laughs> I think it's what, a what did the fried chicken here. look like? Chicken, nigga. Mm, yeah, but when, there's a lot of fried chickens. When I pulled him out of the skillet, he looked niggerish because I burned it up. Oh, uh, there's nothing worse than burnt fried chicken. It was fucking horrible. And then I'm in Sam's today, right? So, you know, I like to run out the house looking like a crackhead, right? <laughs> and I said, I'm just going to run up here to Sam's. I ain't put no lotion on my feet, feet all ashy and shit. <laughs> all of a sudden, I started noticing people doing all this. That's why I <laughs> smiling at me. <laughs> the fuck going on? Jazz said, I told you not to come out here looking like that. I said, what are you talking about? She's like, these people know who you are. I said, no, they don't. They, it was like, <laughs> get out. Everybody just smiling at me in the store. And so this lady said, I see you, I'm Miss Pat, but don't look at my feet, they ashy. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, 
two seasons away from being on TMZ's Twitter looking like that. <laughs> oh, I mean, but I did have on a kind of a new wig and it was fluffy and, you know, the curls had fallen. But I had shit all on my shirt where I went and ate and just dropped shit all on my shirt like a food. And I had on a coat and it was hot as fuck out there. And people, I was like, I was like, oh, I wasn't thinking nobody would know me. So you I, look like a celebrity not trying to be recognized. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You tell them about them right the way. They're like, wow, her undercover disguise is very good. <laughs> One lady was like, I caught your voice. I caught your voice. And I was like, fuck. I'm going to start talking <laughs> through a. I'm gonna stick one of them things on my throat. Hey, give me the washing pile on top shelf. Yeah. What do you think you sound like? <laughs> Damn, you got laryngitis <laughs> once, and I thought you sounded better. <laughs> Fuck you, Chris. <laughs> my fucking muffins. You sound like Nikea's daddy. <laughs> <laughs> That's still one of the fuck. <laughs> you even have oil fun. sheen to spray your ankles. What happens to the oil sheen? I gotta get some oil sheen. <laughs> What is oil sheen? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> my cankles are moist. That's why I'm asking. I don't know. I don't know these things. <laughs> oil, oil sheen for your hair. It's for well, your hair. You spray them off a lens because you can't reach them. That's She's rubbing them together. <laughs> I sure do. <laughs> it's like Soul Glow, but S O L E. Yeah. <laughs> On my ankles. That's exactly what I do. <laughs> and my feet. Because I can't bend over. Good thing you don't run fast. Just set your feet on fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know. Right. Chicken feet back in the day. Daddy used to feed you. You right. You right. My ass, I got to do something. I, I do not want to die fat. I do not. Because, you know, they're going to be looking at me and shit. The people that are bombing. I they thought are. about you the other day. So the big the big story with Oprezic is that people lose weight so fast that now they're having to go, get plastic surgery because their face looks all fucked up and ghostly. Because they look. no weight on Oprezic. Oprezic, I'm about to up my dose tonight. <laughs> <laughs> so your face isn't gonna look like a ghost house. <laughs> I ain't lost shit. Just oh, keep present. Oh, just make me eat. <laughs> just keep cooking <laughs> shitty chicken. You'll be skinny as me. It's really time. named depression. That's what it's really called. <laughs> it's fucking horrible. <laughs> Did y'all see that woman uh, who got buried in the M and M's casket on Twitter? <laughs> yes. <laughs> she the really like nothing without the nut. <laughs> Nigga, I don't know. <laughs> it wasn't a real M&M, nigga. Oh. <laughs> and she was a woman, so I'm quite sure she didn't want the nuts. <laughs> but they yeah. all dressed up as they her. You pulling it up, Chris? Yeah, it's it's <laughs> right here. It's it's the blue M&M, like a peanut-shaped blue M&M with his eyes closed Shut and his up. hand <laughs> on his stomach with a bunch of M&Ms. <laughs> And they're all dressed in Eminem outfits. Is Eminem <laughs> what killed him? I'm guessing. <laughs> Let me see a picture of this bitch who like Eminem. I Let's would want to die with all, all with all my names on my name on cast. Yeah. So and then on the Eminem, why she only, why name she only got four people at her funeral? Did nobody like her? <laughs> <laughs> she has an Eminem casket. She probably only wanted the four colors. That's kind of cool. People get so creative with death now. Is it a woman? <laughs> yeah. It was a grandmother. Yeah. Let's see, Scott Roundtree's got a TikTok here. Them worms gonna enjoy eating that casket. <laughs> it's a slideshow. It's me, Roundtree, is the, the username. Let's see here. Her legs must have been really skinny for them to sit down in there. <laughs> this nigga <laughs> so stupid. This nigga dumb. He said her legs must be real skinny to fit. That isn't the casket. That's the lid. You. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga. 
So you thought they just put her in a peanut? <laughs> in <the group? laughs> I now, can you really do that like Brandon on the show? <laughs> <laughs> Why would you think that lady had a costume <laughs> male grade? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. See, this is why you should uh you should raise your kids on, on weak milk. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, <laughs> her aunt her uncle made it by his uncle made it by hand, her son, but I can't find a picture of her. You that, that's what she looked like. She ate so many M&M, that's what she looked like. <laughs> Did you see the grandmama, the lady I sent it to y'all who stole all the money from the church? I did not see it. Uh, let me see. I know I sent it on Instagram, the pat down. It was a weird let's, let's take a quick break while we pull that up. No. No. Okay, I didn't see you that one, but you can look for it. Yeah, here it is. Right here, I sent it to the pat down. A 72-year-old lady sentenced after stealing five hundred seventy-four thousand dollars from church used fund to uh, for vacation and gambling. How yeah, about man. the nigga at the fucking playground licking the kids' feet? What? <laughs> so let's start with the grandmama. So right. did y'all did y'all edit here, Kate? Did y'all uh did y'all hear about the 72-year-old sentence after stealing five hundred seventy-four thousand dollars from the church you Use fun for vacation and gambling. <laughs> I guess she said she was gonna she was gonna do it before the pastor go out and buy pussy with it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is in Indianapolis, St. Matthew Catholic Church. She did it over 13 years. Dang. Ooh, hustle. Nice. Hey, if she got away with it that long. <laughs> Let her have it. <laughs> Are you the only one blessing from God? And how do they know what she how did she, how she kept she stealing? That's how you know. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta let her win at the casino. <laughs> she hey, she's trying to do like a she's trying to do like a real brother, flip it. <laughs> <laughs> My brother in law said his wife is a gambler. And he said he would come home, put a check on the thing. And go to the gas station, nigga, car, get the car. He's like, I just got paid. I fuck with you. I don't care. Oh my God. This <laughs> gambling everything away. Everything. Everything. And she, you know how gamblers are. They, they, they gamble the shit away. Then come back and try to get the money back. Mm -hmm. She was the worst. He divorced her twice. That's the only way you keep marrying this bitch. She ain't gonna <laughs> stop gambling. She, that nigga is a gambler, to gambler too. Yeah. <laughs> He's so real. Nigga, you you sit in them slot machines long enough, you believe your turn is coming. <laughs> <laughs> it is coming. Soon as you walk out that door, you come going to your car. You coming home. That's it. Oh, uh, and how about this? Uh, I don't fool with people who gamble. I lost two hundred dollars one time. I ran up out that motherfucker. I felt <laughs> I felt violated. You, you, you gotta play. treat it. Uh, then craps and I'm good you? with craps on the corner, but craps at the fucking casino is different. You know, <laughs> I'm like, nigga, I ain't winning because y'all didn't let me get on my knees. Let me get on top of the jump. <laughs> you know, what do you, know, you got to be on your knees to win? <laughs> <laughs> you know, my mom used to rub the you craps know, on our pussy and out behind our neck for good luck and shit. Yeah, I was there was nobody that I could rub on, so that's why I lost. I left. <laughs> I'm looking at Nike and I'm guessing your pussy isn't good luck. <laughs> hey, Nike, that was a joke about you. <laughs> I know, it was pretty funny. <laughs> Man, he <me> dumb, boy. <laughs> it was funny, that's all I like. Okay. He'll get me back later. This sounds like some shit, this sound like some shit <laughs> Nike or daddy be doing. Georgia man arrested for licking the feet of a seven-year-old boy at an at an urban <laughs> air adventure park last month. <laughs> you know that's funny though. We uh when I used to work in the prison, right? I don't think I ever told y'all this story, but we had a guy 
they used to uh, go around and tickle the inmates' feet while they were asleep. <laughs> <laughs> he would tickle them? He would tickle their feet while they were sleeping. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> he just had this thing of tickling four feet that night. That's all he did. Tickle four feet and go around and tickle their feet. <laughs> Can't nobody whoop his ass. Oh, he was ready to beat him up. <laughs> <laughs> Since you don't work in a prison, I'm talking about telling that lady was sucking that dick on 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 the, on the clock. <laughs> hold on, let's finish this story. All right, so we, we had a lady. Right? Hold, hold on, hold on. So with this dude. I read the article that said that he asked the little boy to take his shoes off on the jumping thing. He took his shoes off and he licked his foot. <laughs> he looked like he licked feet. Look at him. <laughs> He's he such kinda, a nice looking guy. He kind of looked like Brandon from the show. That's what exactly what I was going to say, but I didn't want to. <laughs> I, I, I like him too much. <laughs> yeah, he looks like Brandon. <laughs> I want to date lick. Nah, never mind. <laughs> non, he is charged with non aggravated child molestation. Imagine you I, have to I go tell your neighbors you're a child molester, I, but you licked a foot. I, I was going to say, how is it child molestation when you lick somebody's feet? You didn't, you didn't, you didn't break anything open. <laughs> you didn't enter anything. I mean, is that the prerequisite it? for molestation is breaking shit open. I'm just saying, you know, what is it called when you enter? I mean, you. Didn't, I guess they charge him with that because he stuck his tongue between the child toes. So <laughs> you enter something. Penetration. When they like, uh, penetration. Kids, when they was baby. No. Oh. Penetration. No. So he didn't penetrate anything. I'm like. Licking a baby, so you know how many times I picked up a baby feet and kissed it. That was child molestation. If you if you didn't know the kid, it's all about you, consent. If it was a random person's kid and you just started sucking on their toes, yes, that's molestation. <laughs> just can't use no was tongue, a, he was at the he was at the urban airport licking on strangers' feet, and he was there alone. Yeah, he tried to say he was there. Uh, I was just shocked it was child molestation. I thought it was battery. <laughs> yeah, because battery, you just put your, you like put two fingers on a person that's battery. I mean, it doesn't have to even be hard. Yeah, I thought it was battery. I did not know it was child molestation. But whatever he is, he's going to be able to lick the wall in jail for a while. Everybody says <laughs> toes are a gateway drug. So I say lock him up now. What well, you at least he been. You, this man is at at an air park licking boys' feet. Next thing you know, he's going to be trying something else. He's he's should be a sex offender. It's not going to stop there. He's a. He should have went to preschool. He got away with it. <laughs> <laughs> saying there's loose standards at preschool. <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying, if he have went to the Catholic church, he might have got away with it. <laughs> <laughs> he would have gotten some free money if he licked that old lady's feet. <laughs> Uh, he he's he's right on that one. The Catholic Church. Let me shut up. <laughs> <laughs> y'all see that? Y'all see that um lady on Twitter? She called the police on them black men shoveling her drop her sidewalk. No. <laughs> she did what? This old she she's not an American white. She she had an accent. But they was out there shoveling um, the dude's dad's driveway. And to help her out, they shoveled her sidewalk. And she was out there with her shovel putting the snow back on the sidewalk. Wow. And she called the police on them. <laughs> Just because they shoveled the sidewalk in front of her house. She said she was scared for her life. What did the police You're say? It was two white cops. They showed up and they was like, we'll go talk to her. <laughs> Here it's code. You have to clear the sidewalk. It's illegal if you don't. Yeah, I don't know what city it was in, but I saw it on Twitter this morning. They was literally out there shoveling. They was all done. And then she came out there with her shovel. <laughs> she started moving the snow back onto the sidewalk just because she didn't want them to help. And then she called the police on them. And they're like, why are you doing that? We were just trying to help you. She's like, I'm calling the police. <laughs> 
She said, now we're one of those black boys out here with shovels. <laughs> 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 when the cops showed up, they was like, what seems to be the problem? They was like, you just shoveled her sidewalk. The male cop was like, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right. Well, you guys are always bringing up sad stories. I want to bring up a happy story. And th- it is Giuseppe De Anna. She's 76. I'm jealous she of this nigga right that. here. She's got Man. she's got a 19 year old husband now. Um, she's also a billionaire. He don't know what to do with her. Now they're in love. <laughs> yes, he do. He gonna help them ankles go down. Man, I have her folded <laughs> up in so many different positions. <laughs> Look at her with she, her hand he, on her stomach. He's knocking all the dust off of her. <laughs> She's got <laughs> color hair. Look at him in this Louis Vuitton limo. <laughs> this shit kind of looks like the Tinder swindler. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie. The, no, the Tinder swindler is jealous. <laughs> Take my word. He's somewhere jealous. Like, God damn, he hit a loop. <laughs> He, you know, he, he, that young boy hit a old oil mine, oil, oil, what is it called? Oil mine? Yeah. Oil rig? <laughs> oil rig lick. I mean, I mean, just think about, just think about she left him something. Did he have any, did she have any kids? I don't think so, no. Let me Google her a little she bit. Ain't, more and she ain't out. dead. She's still alive. I know. I, I, I don't shit. think she's having kids. And he fucked the shit out of her one night and she don't wake up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is a hoax. Uh, he fooled the internet into thinking he's dating his 76 year old grandmother. Ah, wow. man. <laughs> that's not fun. Oh, that's, that's his that's... grandmother? Yeah, but you know what? Now that you mentioned it, they kind of look alike. Why are you so, kissing her on the mouth? Yeah, that is a little it? weird. He said they were pregnant. Oh, yeah, that's him just going for it Ugh. with her grandmother. <laughs> so just... Oh, that's too bad. So the grandma right, well, rich. But... He rich, too. No, it's all fake. So he nobody's rich? Clout. No, that's his grandmother. She's poor. <laughs> He's just trying Damn, to get Chris. likes on TikTok. <laughs> She poor. You don't know that lady's finances. She's a she's a nobody. God damn. She's just there in Italy being a nobody. You see that sister dress that she had on? She took it back when they after they filmed that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I wouldn't kiss my grandmother's in the mouth for clout. That's gross. <laughs> how how much? There's not an amount of money in the world. So neither one of them was rich. Doesn't sound. I mean, they may be. Dion's right. They may be rich, but it's not real. That's sad. I was having hope for myself. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta go out there and try it again, huh, Dion? Hey, man. I need to find me. <laughs> tired of working. You feel tired of working? <laughs> if I can find me a seventy-five-year-old woman who just needs some dick, she. What's the oldest you had, Dion? 74. Hey! She Wait, was you bad. Fucked a 70, you fucked a 74 year old woman? Uh huh. Jesus Christ. Where'd you meet her? Golden Corral? <laughs> no. <laughs> a buffet is a waste of money for a skinny nigga. Why would I be? Well, she had Corral? a lot of points on her Starbucks card. <laughs> <laughs> I met How her, did you meet her? I met her at the, the comedy church? club. Okay. Uh, she was out what? with her husband. Which. Wait, what? You heard what? me. She you was out with her husband. You, you <laughs> cucked a boomer? <laughs> she was bad, man. I bet. She had a lot of experience. <laughs> she didn't look 74. <laughs> she didn't look 74. What husband is it? He wasn't there, if that's what you ask. Him. Oh, okay. <laughs> she was black or white? She was uh, Middle Eastern. How long you fucked her? Two or three times. Then she went back to California with her husband. Uh, California explains it all. Can she was here. Money? No, no lasting money. <laughs> 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 Nothing I could retire on. <laughs> hey, she, you know, oh, she only gave you lunch money. 
She gave me, she gave me gas money, grocery money. <laughs> that was good dick then. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was weird. She... PlayStation or Xbox? Neither. <laughs> <laughs> how, how many carton of eggs did you get? <laughs> this was years ago. This was like, wait a minute. So you out here fucking old bitches for gas money? I wasn't fucking her for gas money. She didn't look seventy four. She looked like she was in her late thirties. She was bad. Was a pussy good for a seventy four year old? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it did. The sex did not last long. Let's just put it that way. <laughs> what? She started hurting. Her knees hurt. <laughs> it did. It, it 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 didn't take long. And when you she was right. done, she was done. There wasn't no. <laughs> there wasn't no. She didn't give a shit about mine. you. Nah, she gave no fucks. <laughs> what she said? Get the fuck up. She she would come to my crib. This is back when I had roommates and uh. She would come over, get what she needed, and be done. And I'd be like, all right, I'll holler at you later. She would leave some money on my dresser and go. She was, you was a prostitute. You were a gigolo. (laughs) (laughs) You were a gigolo. (laughs) Wow. said Dion was a gigolo. I think I was I was 22 or 23 somewhere around there. Did you have to put, did you have to pick her pussy lips up? No. <laughs> Were they no. longer than Miss Pat? She was she no man, she was fit, y'all. It wasn't some it's not like that lady in the picture you just showed. Did, did you eat her? No. She came right to go. Like when she showed up at the house, it was Come on in. I had to pour no wine and no shit like that. We didn't talk about nothing. <laughs> <laughs> she she walk in my room, take off her little dress, clap them cheeks, and then she would roll out. It's for your ancestors, huh? <laughs> the cheeks, the cheeks <laughs> were for ancestors. Cheeks were clapping near her ankles. <laughs> <laughs> was the booty loose? No, of course. she was oh, fit. No. She Quit was lying. Fit. Why would I lie? <laughs> 74. She look, like, she, had one she didn't little look 74, like, man. She was real soft, Dion. I know she was soft like a pillow. Yeah, I don't like it hard. You know them booties that be flat, but like they got little turkey chins underneath. <laughs> <laughs> Did she have a turkey chin booty, Dion? <laughs> no. She was fit as fuck. She looked like she like was a, like a long W. So did she give you time to come or you just, she'd be like, take your dick out. I got to go. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. She wasn't in a rush. (laughs) I didn't come every time. No. What's I don't care if you're paying me. (laughs) I wasn't doing it for the money. She was cool. You doing it for the gram. hundred dollars. That dick is worth more than $100, Dion. Come on, man. I was, it, it wasn't for Come the on. payment, Chris, man. She was cool. <laughs> <laughs> Dion, I can't believe you used to sell dick. <laughs> <laughs> I did it. <laughs> this is amazing. This is the best story. I'd have fucked it for Ms. free. Miss Pat let her mom's <laughs> Grave on fire. <laughs> wow. Did you ask her, did, could a husband fuck her? I don't know if he could or not. I didn't ask questions I didn't want to know the answers to. Did she use a condom? Of course. Well, she's 75. It's too late for all that. No, uh, that was, it's, been boiling in there. it's been boiling in there since the Nixon administration. You gotta you know, wear a condom. Wow. That syphilis has grandkids. By I, I, I love how you are shocked that I had sex with someone older when you was 12, fucking a 22 year old. It's the same fucking thing. <laughs> you don't be judging me, nigga. But, you know, at that time, we was both young. You fucking somebody like. That lady probably dead now. Probably. <laughs> Somebody great great grandma. <laughs> yeah, I ain't have you no... looked her up Mm-mm. in the obituaries? <laughs> hey, you, no. do you remember her name? Yeah, I remember her name. 
What was her name? name? I'm not saying her name. No, come on. <laughs> <laughs> no. Hey, they don't know her last name. <laughs> just in case. I don't know if her husband did. Her name was just in case. That, yeah, that sounds like <laughs> <laughs> that's her name, just in hey, case. Hey, just in case, pull on up. <laughs> <laughs> Tell all the roommates, just in case on the way. <laughs> just in case I need my rent paid. Just in case I need some gas. Just in case I might be hungry. Just in case I need a new prescription. Nikki, <laughs> you can't laugh at your own joke. <laughs> it's hilarious. Wow. Nikki, you ever slept with an old bitch? No. <laughs> I don't believe that nigga for a second. I can't. I want to sleep with no old man. I don't want to pick up no dick. You still get horny, don't you? Hmm? I say you still get horny, don't you? Horny don't make me no money. <laughs> 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 well, that, that not the case for Dion. I, I'd, I'd agree that there isn't a lot of market for your pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Fresh market you... value is <laughs> <laughs> that catch of the day is <laughs> oh, <Dick. laughs> Bless your heart, Dion. I'm glad you finally came clean with yourself. <laughs> what do you mean? I didn't fuck her for cash. She didn't pay me every time. Mm. Where oh, you met her at the comedy club? I yeah, seekingarrangements.com. <laughs> no, nah, she, she was cool, man. She was she was cool. We went to Land Sharks one time, danced at the club. <laughs> Telling you, man, she didn't look 74, y'all. Did she get carded? Y'all picturing an old, old bitch. She wasn't like that. She ain't look old. I know. In my head, I'm well, thinking of like a, a church lady so I can look, look up on Facebook because even if she's dead, they say, Facebook don't never take down dead people's Facebook page. I don't know why. I doubt she has Facebook. <laughs> Facebook <laughs> was Facebook wasn't even Facebook was for college people. <laughs> was fucking her. This was years ago. So, she, so she's ninety four now. Probably, if she's still alive. Your dick probably killed him. <laughs> <laughs> nah, she she she's went prob- to she went to California. She's probably like Rose on hell. the Titan. <laughs> she's probably like Rose on the Titanic right now, thinking about that dick. <laughs> Just reminiscing. <laughs> I'm quite sure she is. I'm, I, I guarantee she wasn't gonna let you get up on the little rafter thing. <laughs> you weren't getting on the. I, I wasn't going on no cruises with this bitch. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Whew. Well, we learned today. Never I love how never... I, I love how you shocked. Like I, <laughs> you did the exact same thing for no, for three dollar no. jellies. Fifty years, come on! That yeah, the nigga. Uh, this is not a. She was years. twelve. What are you talking about? That's I'm not weird. saying. He I'm not saying. Sick. Yeah, you're right. I'm not saying you're worse than her. I'm saying it's, it's not comparable. <laughs> Age difference. Yeah, I just didn't right. know what she looked like. Yeah, I picture an old, decrepit. This lady was not old and decrepit. You pull your dick. You see, you see, you see how Angela Bassett is in her sixties, right? But she don't look it. So just picture a, a Middle Eastern woman in her seventies, but she don't look it. Okay. So y'all, um, y'all thinking I'm fucking that kid's grandma? It wasn't like that at all. <laughs> yes, it was. But anyway, um, <laughs> put it up, Chris. The city dates. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm very wrong. Tired. Sorry, I... wrong. That's <laughs> Fuck you, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> they won't in and then won't in and woohoo. I had Eddie Murphy as a grandmother in my head. 
Pittsburgh, I'm on my way March 10th and 11th without old pussy. Kansas City Improv, March 17th through the 18th. St. Jose, March 24th through the 25th. Richmond, Virginia, March 31st through April the 1st. Bricktown Comedy, April the 7th through the 8th. Zany's Comedy Club, April 21st through the 22nd. Tacoma, I am coming back, April the 28th through the 29th. Make sure you get your tickets now at misspackcomedy.com. I can't wait to see you guys. I'm excited. I got so much to tell you. Dog, stop fucking with the toys. Oh, that's I literally got... what dogs do. <laughs> yeah. Um, I got so much to share. I cannot wait to share all the good news that I got. Do you know these dogs? My one of my dogs has anxiety. Uh, Living with you, I can believe it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he don't like to be alone. He whine all night like a bitch. And I'm like, Zeus, you gotta stop whining. <laughs> You know, I've been there beating on the case. Stop fucking whining. <laughs> so you don't like to be alone. I think I might just sit him in my room and let him sleep. Thank y'all so much for tuning in to another episode of The Pat Down. Make sure you check out my website at misspatcomedy.com for all of my social media, my tour dates, my book. Make sure you spread the word about my podcast. Please rate and review. Please rate and review and share. Thank y'all so much, y'all. I've been Miss Pat.